Hey everybody, so it's June 5th and I'm at my sixth chemo treatment with my bill. Hi everyone. <laughs> um, feeling okay, hair is holding up, but I do have six more treatments yet left. Um, and yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. Feeling good. How are you feeling, honey? I don't know about feeling as good as this one over here, but <laughs> I'm feeling pretty good. Glad to be here, finally. Yeah. I haven't shown my face a single time. Busy working. Busy yeah, working. what do you think of the treatment so far? Learning a lot. Definitely a lot I've had to find out, actually, by coming here, too, and just speaking with the nurse. Um, Very it's quite the process. Definitely all new to me, other than actually having a grandmother who had cancer, but being here and having a significant other and just dealing with all the side stuff other than actually being at the hospital with just all the emotions it comes with and everything like that. But it's been good staying up, keeping the spirits as good as possible. This one, I can't believe she's doing as good as she's doing, so very thankful for that. Yeah, so I've been having a lot of hot flashes. Like I'm getting one right now and I just get so so hot um for about a couple minutes and i do have this really horrible rash on my hands that um really, horrible. really hurts <laughs> um honestly that's about it i just trying to manage the symptoms manage the hot flashes and um hold on to my hair for as long as possible but um, other than that, everything's good. Headed to the Berkshires this weekend, so mm -hmm. we'll definitely make some more vids when I'm there because it's just so beautiful. All right, guys, have a good one. All right, so all finished with chemo number six and headed back to the Berks. Very successful. Very successful. So I'm excited to just to have a break from the city and relax and, you know, go through my chemo hangover. Hopefully it won't last five days, but I'm expecting like three to four, which is how it's usually been. Last treatment was a little tougher to bounce back than the previous ones. So I'm hoping it won't be like that, but I'm kind of thinking... It's just gonna keep building my body and it might be getting you know more difficult every time but um, like I've said in previous videos I've been um, using tincture and THC tincture of THC and CBD oil three times a day and throughout this whole process and I really think that that is just a huge reason why I um, feel as good as I have through this process and I'm really thankful for that and I really can't like recommend that to anyone who's going through chemotherapy um, as an alternative to pain medication and an alternative to sleep medication and an alternative to you know not having to lose weight basically like it it, it gives me an appetite and therefore I've only been gaining weight so I guess that's also been helping me like stay healthy and feel strong um so yeah just wanted to mention that to you guys and um I I keep meaning to do a video about the CBD and THC and you know kind of an educational video and I will do that soon um, all right talk to you guys later